What is up, guys? Welcome back to another awesome episode of Railroads Online. My name is Evil One, and this is the Ramblin' Railroad. I have Toltree with me today. Say hello, Toltree. Hi. We're down here at the smelter, and we're going to load up Beast. He's got 14 of these Tier 2 uh, flat stake cars, and he's going to be loading up these last little bit of raw iron. But So why don't you, why don't you go ahead and get started on that, Toltree, if you can. I greatly appreciate it. And uh, I'm going to grab Stout over here at the rail yard and bring over some cordwood. As you can see here, there's no cordwood. And uh, we got a mountain of iron ore. Let's see, we have 432 of this. So we're going to run over here and grab Stout. And it's hooked up to the supply of cordwood cars over here that are fully loaded. We just got to drag it over there and, and get, offload it. And then it'll start making some more raw iron for us. So, Toltree, did you uh, watch the video? Oh, yeah, you you watched, uh, uh, we did the premiere thing with um, Dolan, right? Yeah, I was in there with you. Yeah, that's crazy, you guys seeing those trains popping like that. I, I, I knew about that phenomenon, but I never, you know, really experienced it before. So, that is insane. Yeah, I'm experiencing it. I'm experiencing it now. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> so here I got Stout hooked up. Then we gotta take, I think we can take four of these cars and get in there. One, two, three, four. That'll leave us with three left. We'll break the train right here. And we gotta turn off all these brakes. Now we'll go reverse her back. Brake is already off. And we'll give it the beans. Start dragging these four cars backwards. If I need to move the train backwards, just let me know. Okay. Now I'm coming alongside your train right now. I'll back up and set the switch for you. Awesome, I appreciate it. You're set to go. Cool, thank you. Welcome. I gotta flip this switch. That'll get me in there. And I'm gonna be engine first, which is gonna take up a little bit of extra space. But I see that I only grabbed three cars. So I guess that's not a problem. I just noticed that I didn't grab four. Oh well. Start applying brake, because these are super heavy. And I don't wanna smack that stop going 100 miles an hour. I'm just kinda coast in here. Yeah, that's not a good idea. Yeah. Nice and gentle, but I do want to hit it. Full break. That way we can maximize all the dock space. Boop. Oh, we bounced. Ouch. Okay. Right. We'll get these offloaded here. Okay, so I'm going to go a different route so I don't interfere with you anymore. I'm going to go out this way and it's then fine. back up. Break off, reverses forward, give it all the regulator. Now that we're unloaded, I can actually move a little bit easier. Should be using my whistles. That was kind of fun. I don't really ever use the whistles, 
but uh, during that last multiplayer, everybody was using the whistles, and it's kind of nice. Yeah, it was. I'm just not doing whistles at the moment because I'll be spamming them every time I go forwards and backwards trying to line up the bar. Right. Yep. <laughs> I can use it. How many more you got to go? Roughly. I'm just barely over the switch. Do you need some space? Oh no, I I'm almost over to the rail yard again. I'm going a different route. Kind of a, oh, it's, a, it's, a okay. it's a longer route, but it it won't interfere with you. I'm just going in your direction. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, no! Oh, <laughs> I missed the switch. <laughs> I hear a derailment. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh no. Stop! My car's rolling down the hill without me. That breaks. There we go. <laughs> Let's see, I can get this cleaned up a little bit. Never fails. Alright. Got that cleaned up. Turn off all these brakes. And switch is set right now. All right, break off full throttle. Pull the train up past the switch, and then I'll go down the hill that way. Looks like Toltree's getting pretty close. I see the end of his train. It's around the curve now. I have six more cars to load after this one. Awesome. We'll just be parking these cordwood cars in this little yard here. Just get them out of the way. It's a nice short little dead end yard. Makes it easy just to grab them and, and go fill them up again at a later date. Just down to my last three to load. Okay. I just set the parking brake. Heading your way. I was really hoping to get both those trains, Good. but uh, Toltree's a little too fast, so... <laughs> and it looks like our switches are correct. I'll help you load. If you want to run the locomotive instead of running back and forth, it's got to be time time consuming. It's a long train. Okay. Yeah, it is. I can't even see it from my spot. Oh, nice. Uh, go ahead a half. Yeah, we were standing. I don't see any flat part. <laughs> the stakes are invisible. Are you in the locomotive? I'm going to pull it forward. Yep. Had about a half. Stop. We'll see how that looks. Just being pushed by the weight of the train. Yeah. It's all right. We didn't lose anything. We need to back up. Okay, backing up. Back up one. Go ahead and apply the brakes. Okay, that was a little early. Back up a half. There's a lot of slack in this train too. It's a long train. This is usually this is a little bit longer than I like to pull. Go ahead and stop right there. All right, I okay. can do that. Are there 17 state flat cars? Uh, I think there's 14. There must be an odd number because I was e loading them evenly. 
There's one left at the back. Oh. Interesting. Maybe I, you know, I just miscounted those cordwood cars. It's entirely possible that I can't count at all. So, <laughs> so I, I'll count them on my way back if you want to line me up for uh, this last one. So that's two, okay. three, four, five, six. I counted 17. Yeah, that's 17. Um, I'm going to go ahead and check the calculator again. 17, it's it's can do it with 5.24% despair. That's not a big margin. <laughs> so hopefully we can do try it. it. What? Go, go ahead. You think we can try it? Yeah, well, we, we can only fail, right? So if we cut a car loose, then we cut a car loose. It's not a big deal. Pull break. Let me know how much I need to pull for. Yeah, half car. Perfect. All right. All right, we'll get this last car loaded up here, and Toltry and I will take Beast. Hopefully, climb a 3% hill. <laughs> we'll see. It's a 5.24% to spare. It's going to be a tough, tough climb, I think. I'll sit in the locomotive to make sure we're at least going 100% on regulator. Yeah. You stoked the fire? Yes, I made sure it was just, um, filled. It's at awesome. 82. I'm wondering if maybe we should grab Stout, the little switcher engine down here, and just hook him up to the back. Maybe help push. What do you think? It's not a bad idea. I'm going to go grab Stout. Uh, if you want to pull forward... You know that switch that I came off of with the cordwood? If you want to pull the end of the train up to that switch so I can just hook up to the back. All right, anywhere in there is perfect. I will go grab Stout and I hook him up stop. to the back. Put a link and a pin in this one. Were you able to get it started? Oh yeah, yeah, I just hooked up to the back of your train. Okay. So let me put some fire in it. Go right, ahead. So and... Stout's been promoted to a banking engine. I'm so sorry to say that again. That's no, all right. I said Stout's been upgraded to a banking engine. A banking engine? I'm not familiar it with was that term. Promoted, yeah. <laughs> if you ever look up Big Bertha, uh huh. Or say like. Pennsylvania Railroad would use them to go up the Allegheny Mountains. Oh. Well, Big Bertha was in the UK, but Pennsylvania would usually have banking engines. Okay. They do that still with diesels. Mm hmm Like, have you ever seen a train and there's diesels on the front and diesels at the back? Yeah, yeah. I didn't know that they were called banking engines, though. That's interesting. Yeah, it's a weird term. So I'm set back here if you want to... Let me know when you're ready to start down. Yeah, um, I'm not gonna. I'll start up. What's that? I start pulling you here. Yep, I'm not gonna apply any power until we start climbing the grade. So I'll just let you kind of drag me around, and all the switches should be set all the way until the Mountain Valley Rail Yard. So we we'll have to flip a few switches from that point forward, but everything should be good until we get there. Okay, I'll start it up. This is so cool. <laughs> the popcorning is really bad on my end. Oh no. Does that make it more difficult? It's not affecting the train at all, it's just... Yeah. Does that make it more difficult to, uh, to drive the train though? I mean, I, I noticed in that last one, it seemed like the trains were actually moving a lot faster than they were. And they weren't, weren't like in the right pos positions and stuff. It was so strange to see that. 
No, it doesn't. All right, I'm at full regulator. Oh, no, that was just weird. Because we are now climbing. I just kicked it reverse because I thought we just derailed. It was pretty bad. <laughs> Like it detached from the tender and just kept going. Oh, nice. While everything else just started derailing. I'm at full. Uh oh. Why am I losing boiler pressure? I put wood in this thing. Same thing, I got plenty of water. Oh, that's not good. Am I losing boiler pressure? It's climbing. But I, I put wood in it a while ago, but it just must be taking a while. We're going, though. Did you run it low? I think so. I have half a tank of water. <laughs> yeah, it sucks. The porters are really thirsty. Yeah. They got small little tanks on them. That was weird. I'm seeing your steam. Are your steam cocks open? No, they're not. Oh. It looks like they are on my end. I'll turn them on real quick and see if it disappears. Uh-uh. No, it's all still there. Weird. It didn't show up on my end, then I just clicked it off, and does it still show? Yeah. That's hey. weird. <laughs> Come on, beast. It flattens out up here, so hopefully we can pick up a little bit of speed before hitting this bridge. The bridge is going to be tough. It's It was set at 3%, but the apparently there's a bug with it where it's not actually 3%. It's probably going to be steeper or something like that. We should have enough momentum that we're going to make it over. I hope so. See how when I did that uh, double header pulling this grade right up here. I did the entire thing with Beast at like 80% throttle, and I didn't realize it. And right here, I like stalled out. So, that was yeah, really... I was trying, I'm trying to make sure I'm in the train and I can have full controls ready on the bottom of the screen. Yeah. So I'm at 100. Nice. I think we got this no problem. Yeah, we're doing good. I'll run back to uh, Stout and disconnect him when we get to the sawmill and just park him there. And then we'll continue on. Okay. Oh, it's chuffing down. <laughs> It's not so bad. At least it doesn't look like it's derailing. That's good. Yeah, on my end it looks great, as far as that goes. My train looks like it's been sitting in the microwave for 15 minutes. <laughs> it's really bouncing everywhere. That's so weird that it does that. Hopefully that you yeah, I'm get really that hoping fixed. the spline update just fixes everything. Yeah. Boy, Stout back here is just screaming. I don't even see Stout. <laughs> Do you see me at all? No. Wow. I can see about the first 10 cars and that's it. I think I need to play on somebody else's world just so I can experience, you know, firsthand what it's like to be a client. Nice, we made it. It's all flat from here all the way to the ironworks. All right, good.
am I set to go to the ironworks on the switches? Uh, until we hit the Mountain Valley Rail Yard, uh, then we'll have to flip some switches, but I'll take care of all that for you. When we get up to your, to the sawmill, I'll okay. just disconnect um, Stout. And actually, I could just probably do that right now, actually. Yeah, I'll just do it right now. I'll leave him sitting on the main line. Not a big deal. Bye-bye, buddy. Thank you. <laughs> I'll come up and join you. That's so weird. So I do know that uh, Captain Slow told me that he left him open for me uh, when he parked Beast. But I saw that they were closed and I jumped in it, but now it looks like they're open. Let me see if I can close them in first person here. What is that? What's what? Oh, the lever just looked really weird. Okay. Now they're closed. Interesting. Yeah, if you've never seen this popcorning for yourself, you should. <laughs> it's just mind-boggling how you don't derail, and it just looks like it's exploding from the inside. And at least it's just made of rubber. Well, some, some of those clips I saw, you know, from Dolan's uh, stream and, and from Captain Slow, like the tender just like flying apart and you know, heading off into space is just insane. And all of a sudden it's there again and it happens about every two seconds. Good lord. That's insane. <laughs> like I, I knew it was a thing. Really I, is, I've yeah. seen other people's clips of it, but you know, seeing it on my own railroad, you know, somebody else while I'm you know, it looks normal in my end, but I see somebody else's same version of the same story and it's completely different. So weird. Okay, slow down, please. I gotta look at these switches. Right. I think I gotta flip one. Let's see, this is so confusing through here. Now that one's right. That one's right. That one's right. Okay, nope, we're good. Keep keep on going. I'll run down to the other end, though. Okay. All pointing inbound. All right. We're good. For a while, anyway. Sounds good. Do you fire. want to take over train operations? Uh, if you want me to. Okay. Can you see the locomotive from back there? No. <laughs> this is, that to me is also mind-boggling. I can see you and you're just jumping up and down. Oh, really? Nice. <laughs> yeah. Hey, you look like Mario trying to hit a question mark block. <laughs> That's great. Yeah, you look like Mario trying to hit a question mark block. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, and hopefully. that question mark block I was saying was actually the doors. Oh, nice. They just got left behind. <laughs> well, they're still on the locomotive, so hopefully they get that fixed. Oh. Yeah, it's just really odd. How did you want to do this? You want to keep it at a steady pace and unload it from there? Or stop and Shh. unload for each car? Yeah, we can do a rolling offload. Um, so with somebody at the controls, it makes it a little bit easier. So if you want to unload them. It's a pretty big platform. We'll okay. slow down a little more too here. As it speeds up as you start to you know lose weight, sometimes it gets going really really fast, especially with the longer trains. It's probably best that the host does this because from my perspective it just looks like the train stops and goes randomly. Okay. That's probably not the best idea. You You wanna do the the stop unload? Or do you wanna drive the train? If you don't mind driving. Oh, yeah, I can drive. It's just hard for me to guess which spot to stop at. I'll uh, hit the brakes there. Come back here and take a look. 42. Very nice. Yeah, it consumes some. Yeah. I was hoping so because we really need uh, these pipes to go up to the refinery. That's why we we're low on lumber. This. Yeah, we're low on lumber. So we need to get lumber here, and then we need to get the pipe cars and the oil tankers, and then we can head up to the refinery again. And uh, make it like a, a big train or something up there, and then bring back the oil barrels. And so, hmm. out of that, what do you want to do? Anything? Would you say we run two separate trains if you want to collect all the black cars, and I'll take the flat state cars up to the sawmill, and I'll load up the lumber? Okay, yeah, that works. So I'll go get the uh, flat cars, the 100 series black cars okay okay sounds good actually I'll ride with you up there I'll get your switches I just got disconnected oh Oops. no This is nice. <laughs> what? I said this is nice. Standing here, middle of the train. <laughs> just don't even have to touch the locomotive, and it's just... On my end, it just looks horrible. <laughs> it looks like a nightmare. <laughs> yes. So I got Maverick parked right up here at the Mountain Valley Rail Yard. Uh, if you want to take the controls of Beast and go get these loaded up with lumber, I'll grab him and go get those 100 okay. series and uh, the flat cars and take them down to the ironworks and start loading up steel pipe. 
Okay. That's good. And your switches should be set to the sawmill. So, it's the way we came. Yeah. You might have to do some switching at the sawmill. Yeah, I'm gonna set the switches. Yeah, I'm just running ahead to do that now. I see you running backwards. <laughs> yeah, anytime I look back at Beast, it's just given out. Reality doesn't apply to it. <laughs> All right, I'll get Maverick warmed up here. Just got to the freight depot. I'm going to try and line myself into get this flat car train there we go do you remember how much coal was at the ironworks uh it was over well over 100 we should be good okay on coal so i'll just well. fill up all these flat state cars with lumber yeah it'll well exceed 50 but it'll drain up fast Let's see, I need to actually look at the calculator really fast to determine how many of these cars I need. Okay, I can only take five of them. That's a, that's a, quite a bit of uh, steel pipe anyway. Boom. Contact. Let's see, one, two, three, four. Break the train right there. Turn off all these brakes. And I actually have five this time. I can count. Yay. <laughs> it's good. I'm loaded up my five flat, flat cars. And I'm almost to the Mountain Valley Rail Yard. So... Your switches going through there will probably be correct, but uh, no, I'll, I'll set them for you though. How about that? As, as I go through. Thank you. Yeah, that works. Gave it a little bit of break to slow down so I can run ahead. Apparently, I left it just barely on. I brought my train to a complete stop. That's not good. Whoa. Oh, no. Why'd you derail? What happened? I derailed. <laughs> Oh no. Yeah. Oh, I s threw the wrong switch. So there's two here, like right next to each other, and I picked the wrong one. Oh no. <laughs> That's the big problem with having a giant rail yard. Yeah. Easy to get confused. Alright, now we can go. <laughs> Four words.
All right, I'm going through the Mountain Valley Rail Yard right now. I just set your first switch, so should be good. Okay. All the way there. If you're out of stuff to do, you want to come over to the sawmill and help out? Yep. I'll be there in just a few minutes. Okay. I'm just about done loading up this last little bit of steel pipe. All right, take your time. Here, let me flip a couple of switches here for you, and then I'll use the uh, Railroad Online extension just to teleport over there. Give you a hand. Okay. If it'll let me, we'll see. Hopefully it doesn't crash the game. I should probably save it. That's been a while. <laughs> yeah, save it real quick. <laughs> While well, the trains are stopped. Alright. Here I come. Wow. Oh, you're going in reverse. I see. Okay. I almost had to because if I came in the forward, it was just gonna keep slipping over a uh, uh, unloading dock. So by pulling it forward, I could judge by every two cars how far back I needed to go. Okay. Well, if uh... I know it's not practical because of string lining possibility. Well, if you want to back up, are you where? Are you, where are you? Truth is, I got kicked, and oh. <laughs> I'm on my way. Okay. Because whenever I load up the lumber, it just kicks me out right after the fifth one's loaded. Oh no! I think it might be a bug, though. I'm not sure if this bugs you or not, but one of the uh, state cars. Is missing the lumber. Oh, no way, really? It's just holding five. Way back there. That's the one I'm standing on. Probably the one that is, yeah. Yeah. Okay, we can pull forward. Yeah, that bothers me. <laughs> we'll pull forward here and get it filled up in just a second. in here to the iron works with a full load of lumber toll tree is uh, up here right, somewhere I'm not sure if my calculations I've calculated 29 lumber will be left over at the iron works awesome I hope I'm right <laughs> I might be off by three or so eh, it is what it is thank you for doing the math you're welcome. We have we have extra. We have extra. It's not a big deal. It's just less we have to take back and forth. Exactly. So, oh, I need to brake like hard. This is a heavy train. I mean, to unload this? Uh, not yet. I'm going way fast. If you have the uh, yeah the reverser back, pulls you can. Right. I just want to do it all manually. I'll just, uh, we'll do the rolling offload, maybe, well, it's six of them, that's a really short platform. Alright, we actually lined up pretty good, didn't, yeah, didn't we? Really I'm not too sure if this one was going to make it, the first one. Uh, let me get out and look. second one will. Yeah, we'll back up for this first one, just a little bit. Are we able to do the rolling offload? If you're able to slow down a little bit. Yep. That's good. All right. Able to stop real quick? Yep. If I load up any more, it's going to spill over. Gotcha. And not consume it. Okay. Dude, now we're at a 116. Sitting at 48 out of 50. Yeah. 
and two raw iron that uh, we got a mountain of steel pipe 68 steel pipes boy it really likes that raw iron doesn't it yeah My calculations are a little off. Eh. I don't do math, so thank you for doing it. <laughs> That's cool looking, though. Yeah, I'm not good at it. <laughs> yeah, it is. Uh, uh, There's only four state cars left that spool of lumber if you want to leave them off somewhere. Yeah. The question is where. Actually, these might be pretty good to take up to the um, refinery. Alrighty, folks, that's going to do it for this one. Thank you so much for watching. I had a bucket of fun. Thank you to Toltree for coming along and helping out, driving trains and loading trains and everything that you do, including the math. I appreciate it. So you have any uh, parting words? Yeah, don't trust me for math. <laughs> it's all good. So, all right, we'll get the rest of this taken care of in a, in a future episode. Again, thank you. Have a wonderful night. Bye for now.